McIntosh. So, uh, my favorite match of the night, 145. Not yours. Okay? Your guy has this high volume of shots. He's all over the guy, right? He was in on six super deep shots. Couldn't, I think he finished one maybe, right? And then it gets into, he gets caught in a, in a big move, right? And it kind of changes the tide of things. Yeah. Is that why you guys come here, though, to, to learn things like that? Yeah, 100%. I mean, uh, we lost two matches tonight in the finals. In the finals, um, first, and those matches gave us what we need to work on. You know, at 26, uh, Nick Hart lost to Hacker, got rid of the boots. So we know where we know where Nick Hart needs to work on. He needs to work on getting out of the legs. Alec Martin, we need to work on finishing our shots. Uh, he's get, getting through the legs, no problem. We just got to finish fast. You know at the highest level, you got to finish a shot. If you're not finishing fast, guys are too good to scramble. So. And that's the, you know, and I've talked about it. The big test this year is going to be Lewis, Fell, St. V. All these teams are coming for you, obviously. Aurora, right. who you get a sample with today, which is awesome for you. But the thing that comes down for me is the district tournaments. And you got a much more favorable district, so i got to favor you guys. That's just how I look at it, right? right? you got a better district, right? 100%. I mean, the Southwest District is, uh, I mean, yeah, we have some tough, we have some tough matchups. I mean, Wortham's there at 38. Uh, Wortham's a two-time state placer. Uh, so Nick Moore will get to see him. Uh, I think Bishop Hartley moved in our, into our district as well, so they're tough. You know, they came out of Central, moved down to the Southwest. So we'll, we'll get some good matchups there, but... Um, definitely not a meat grinder like the Northeast. Yeah, the Lake Catholic. Yeah. I mean, they got everybody there. Yeah, I mean, so well, they're going to beat Aurora, each other up. The Aurora, Louisville, Miller Lake Catholic, St. Vincent, St. Mary's. Uh, I think, what, six or there's like six guys that are ranked at 113 pounds that are all at the same, all at the same, or at 106 pounds that are all at the same district. I don't know if they know how rankings work, but the only 16 get to Russell State, yeah, right? Yeah. Right? But, you know, and that's an advantage for you guys, and it's geography. That's not like you guys, you know right, what I mean? Right. So I'll take it if I'm you, right? Yeah, um, I more Moore's knee is not good. You don't have to share what it is, but his knee is not good. He's limping. He's on one leg out there. Gets a major decision. What's that say about him and his toughness? Uh, he's a tough kid. He's uh, he's on the mending end of it. Um, so he, he kind of got banged up a little bit. She said wrestled well last weekend at, at, against St. Ed's. And then Russell, I thought he competed well this weekend. Now we have a week off um, before the state dual regionals. So get some guys back healthy, get their minds right, and go to work. So that, you know, when you look at the state duels, obviously you're going to get to see probably Aurora, Louisville, a combination of somebody again, right? When you look at that, you know, like, do you get to rest for two weeks now? Is that something where you get to put them down a little bit and let, let them rest a little? Yeah, we'll rest for this week. And then, uh, you know, we'll, we'll still obviously train, but not beat up our bodies as much. Next week, then we have region, the regionals. So um, our regionals are actually decent. I mean, we have teams like Wasion and Napoleon coming down to our place, Southwest District, for our regional. That's pretty good. Cool. So it should be good. We should, we should get some good matches there. But uh, moving forward, then we've got to concentrate on the state dual sectionals, district state. So when you guys look at this, you know, everybody, you know, you won state as a, a freshman coach, essentially, right? And, you know, repeat. You know, it's reload down there at Graham. What do you guys got to do to ultimately take the trophy home in March? Uh, my Gold guys, trophy. Yeah, my guys have to, uh, we talk about this every day. My guys have to compete to the best that they can possibly compete. If we can compete to the best that we can compete, um, and they've done that time in and time out, that's why our schedule, if you look at our schedule this year, it's, it's loaded. We went Ironman to hol our holiday, went to the Chief Shed, wrestled Union County, uh, Kentucky, and Mason. Then, went, then we're here, you know, we're wrestling a tough schedule, so when we get to the state tournament, it's just another tournament. So, uh, my guys are prepared. I, I truly believe that I have guys out that are hungry, guys that have been there before, so that's that's the nice part as well. So, All right, you got anything else for me? That's it, man. Thank you. Thank you for the time. Good luck to you guys moving forward. I can't wait to beat state duels. Can't wait to see you at the Jottenstein. It's going to be a good year. Good luck to you guys. Go Falcons. Thanks, go Falcons.